expecting a cool end to the weekend, but a big warm up's on the way for the next couple of days. We'll stay nice and quiet for this Sunday, but very above average temperatures move in already by tomorrow afternoon. If you're going to be finishing up that holiday travel today, good to go. And for most of this week ahead as you're heading to work, also those roads are going to be staying pretty clear. We're not going to really see many chances for rain, maybe some sprinkles on Tuesday afternoon, but other than that, very dry in our region. And we'll see that today. Lots of sunshine, but it barely warms us up. We maybe make it to those upper 40s, but right around those seasonal averages, that's only about as warm as we're supposed to be for late November. We're still going to get pretty chilly this evening. If you've got dinner plans right around dinner time tonight, going to start slipping back into those upper 30s. So you just want to have that heavier coat for this Sunday, but really won't need that for the rest of this week. Already tomorrow, about in those 60s even across the region. That is a very big warm up. We're already going to be about 10 degrees above average, but a little bit cooler maybe for Tuesday and Wednesday. This is as I'm tracking a disturbance through that might bring some sprinkles here, but not going to be really delaying that warm up too much. We could even warm up further into the later or days of the week here. Now you can still see starting off very chilly again. If you're heading out early on this Sunday, you want to be staying bundled up and maybe just keep an extra layer on hand this afternoon as well. This is thanks to a lot of northerly flow across our area. These winds are very chilly this morning and that's already going to be cooling us off this afternoon right around 50 degrees and then very, very cold overnight. Now we will see a little bit of cloud cover heading into Monday morning. Still good to get out for that commute. Not going to be tracking any showers. You can see maybe just well off to the west, a cold front starting to get close to our region. That's going to really pass over us Monday, but won't really notice it too much. It's actually going to push those clouds out of here by Monday afternoon. And that coupled with some of these southerly winds returning is going to push us again, maybe to those low to mid 60s even in some areas. That is very well above average for what we should be this time of year. And it's going to last into the middle of the week as well. Here's that disturbance. We're tracking. It looks like we're going to see a front settle across our area that looks like just to our south, just south of I-70 at least. And then it's going to keep temperatures a little bit more tame for Tuesday. We're going to maybe start out a little bit further away from freezing, maybe getting some showers though by the afternoon. And that doesn't really look to cool us off too much. We're still on track to get above average into those mid 50s Tuesday. And then once we dry out the rest of the work week, we're still going to be warming up again, maybe back to those mid 60s and Thursday. But we'll be seeing some of these long range models pick up possibly on some showers into next weekend that might bring a return to those seasonal temperatures.